Good evening and welcome to News 24. This is Shahrina Wahid with the top news of the day. After two days, all the shops in Nilkhet area of Dhaka were reopened. After the announcement of mutual understanding on Thursday morning, the shopkeepers started opening their shops. As the day progresses, shoppers flock to the markets to buy essential products. New Market, Chondrima Supermarket, Gaussia Market, New Mansion, Hawkers Market, New Supermarket and all the surrounding shops reopened. The shopkeepers said they incurred huge losses as the market was closed for two days. Traders say that the decision taken in the teacher-student businessman meeting is positive. Meanwhile, despite the opening of the shops, the panic has not yet fully subsided and additional police were deployed to prevent any kind of chaos. Morseline, who was seriously injured in the clashes at Newmarket, could not be saved. He died on Thursday morning while undergoing treatment at the ICU of Medical, Dhaka Medical College. The 26-year-old shopkeeper was injured during being hit by a brick two days ago during a clash between Dhaka College students and traders of Newmarket area. His home was in Daudkandi of Kumilla, but he lived in Dhaka in the western Rasulpur area of Kamrangichor. His elder brother Noor Muhammad said Mursalin was married with two children aged six and four. Earlier, another 18-year-old courier service employee named Nahid Hussain died on Tuesday night. Meanwhile, thousands of people were charged in three cases with regard to clashes. Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina has said that the development of the country is becoming visible as people have repeatedly elected al -Mali. She said that due to the special initiative of his, her government towards industrialization, now 767 products are being exported to 202 countries of the world. She said the wheel of the economy is still moving in corona epidemic, also with various initiatives of the government. Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina inaugurated the foundation stone of Ghorashal Polish Fertilizer Factory and four development projects of the Ministry of Industries. Joining the video conference from Ghanubhabun, the Prime Minister unveiled the cover of the book titled Bangabundhur Shilpudarshan o Shilpayon Uttaron. BNP Secretary General Mirza Fokhr Islam Alamgir has claimed the German ambassador had misinterpreted the content of the recent meeting with the party. He made the allegation to reporters after paying tribute to the tomb of President Zia Rahman on Thursday morning. He said the government has completely failed to run the country. He also criticized the government's role in the clashes in the new market area. He said there were casualties in the new market area as uh, there was a no government action in the clashes. And that is all the news for today. Thank for watching News24. Please be with us.